Imagine a life where you don't have to worry about money and your every need is met in the most luxurious way. These are the things that Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman does in his life. Stay tuned, because we're about to show you how one of the world's richest and most controversial people lives. Mohammed bin Salman, also written as Mohammed bin Salman, is a king. He has a lot of power and money because he will soon be king of Saudi Arabia. His life isn't just about politics and being a leader, though. Also, it's full of high-class and fancy things that most of us can only dream of. He is famous all over the world for both his political power and the bad things he has done. Mohammed bin Salman has a very fancy life, full of expensive yachts and houses worth millions of dollars, despite these problems. Early life and education, Mohammed bin Salman, who is usually just called MBS, was born into a very wealthy and privileged family. The fact that his family is part of the Saudi royal family meant that he grew up in style. It was important to his parents that he had the best of everything, especially in school. One of the oldest and most prestigious universities in Saudi Arabia, King Saud University, is where Mohammed bin Salman went to school. He got his Bachelor of Laws here, which set him up well for his future career in government. After getting his degree, Mohammed bin Salman went to work for different state offices as a civil servant. His smarts and hard work made him stand out right away. He had many jobs in the government, and each one helped him get ready for bigger ones. With little time, he quickly rose through the ranks. By 2009, he was a special advisor to his father, who was governor of Riyadh at the time. These duties gave Mohammed bin Salman useful experience and knowledge about how the Saudi government works. Ascension to power, Mohammed bin Salman's rise to power accelerated in 2012, when his father, Salman bin Abdulaziz, became crown prince. This began Mohammed bin Salman's influence in the royal family and government. When his father became king in 2015, Mohammed bin Salman's duties increased. As deputy crown prince and crown prince, he was next in line for the throne. This was when Mohammed bin Salman held key government positions. He became one of the youngest ministers of defense in the world. He also implemented economic and social reforms to modernize Saudi Arabia, including lowering oil dependence and encouraging private sector growth. He envisions diversifying Saudi Arabia's economy and improving health, education, infrastructure, and tourism with his Vision 2030 initiative. Controversies and political influence, even though Mohammed bin Salman rose quickly and had big plans, his path has been marked by major scandals. The killing of writer Jamal Khashoggi in 2018 was one of the most important events. Khashoggi was killed inside the Saudi embassy in Istanbul. The CIA later found that Mohammed bin Salman had given the order to kill him. Many countries around the world condemned what happened, and it made ties between Saudi Arabia and many other countries more difficult. Besides the Khashoggi case, Mohammed bin Salman was also charged with getting into the phone of Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos in early 2019. According to the claims, a message from Mohammed bin Salman's WhatsApp account had malware in it that took over Bezos' phone. The Saudi government said these claims were ridiculous and not based on evidence, but the event made people look more closely at what Mohammed bin Salman did. Wealth and assets, the Saudi ruling family is known for having a huge amount of money, about $1.4 trillion. A big chunk of this wealth is controlled by Mohammed bin Salman, who is one of the richest people in the world. His wealth comes from many places, such as huge oil stores and investments made through the Public Investment Fund of Saudi Arabia. The oil company Saudi Aramco, which is owned by the government, is one of his most valuable properties. The market value of Aramco reached $2 trillion in 2019 when it went public. This made it the most valuable company in the world. This one thing gives Mohammed bin Salman a lot more cash power and influence. Besides his money, also owns a lot of expensive buildings and things. A $500 million boat called Serene is part of his collection. It has swimming pools, hot tubs, helipads, and even a movie theater. Saudi Aramco. A significant portion of Mohammed bin Salman's wealth comes from Saudi Aramco, the most valuable company in the world. In 2019, Saudi Aramco went public, and its valuation soared to $2 trillion. This makes it more valuable than tech giants like Microsoft, Apple, and Google. The company is a massive oil producer, and its profits have greatly increased Mohammed bin Salman's wealth and influence. The success of Saudi Aramco is a key part of why Mohammed bin Salman is one of the richest people globally. Palatial Residences Mohammed bin Salman lives in some of the most luxurious homes in the world. 
Al Yamama Palace, located in Riyadh, is where he hosts important guests from around the globe. It's a grand place designed to impress with its vast halls and elegant decorations. Another residence, Ergo Palace, is known for its gold-plated fixtures and beautiful marble interiors, showcasing Mohammed bin Salman's love for luxury. Besides these, he has several other homes in places like Switzerland, London, France, and Morocco, each one a testament to his immense wealth and lavish lifestyle. Extravagant purchases, Mohammed bin Salman has a taste for incredibly expensive items. He owns a yacht named Serene, which cost him $500 million. This yacht isn't just big, it's like a floating palace with pools, hot tubs, helipads, and even a movie theater. He also bought a Leonardo da Vinci painting for $450 million, making it one of the most expensive artworks ever purchased. Another impressive purchase is the Chateau Louis XIV in France, which cost him $300 million. This chateau is a modern castle with fountains, lights, and air conditioning that can all be controlled by a single iPhone. Mohammed bin Salman kept the purchase of this chateau a secret for years, showing his preference for privacy when it comes to his luxurious acquisitions. Lifestyle and leisure. Mohammed bin Salman's lifestyle is filled with luxury and comfort. He has a collection of super yachts, private jets, and helicopters, allowing him to travel in style wherever he goes. His clothing is often custom made from the finest materials, ensuring he always looks his best. When it comes to food, Mohammed bin Salman enjoys meals made from the best ingredients flown in from around the world. Imagine having your breakfast ingredients imported from France every day. This is the kind of indulgence Mohammed bin Salman can afford. His lifestyle is a blend of extravagance and exclusive taste. Technological affluence Mohammed bin Salman loves to integrate the latest technology into his life. One example is the Chateau Louis XIV, which is equipped with advanced tech features. Everything in the Chateau, from the lights to the air conditioning, can be controlled using a single iPhone. This shows Mohammed bin Salman's appreciation for convenience and cutting-edge technology. He enjoys having the best gadgets and innovations at his fingertips, making his life more comfortable and efficient. Public image and speculations, public opinion about Mohammed bin Salman is mixed. Many people are fascinated by his immense wealth and luxurious lifestyle. They see him as a symbol of modern royalty, living a life that most can only dream of. However, others criticize him for his opulence, especially in light of the political controversies he is involved in. There are ongoing speculations about his undisclosed assets and hidden wealth, with people constantly debating how much he truly owns. This curiosity and debate add to the intrigue surrounding Mohammed bin Salman, making him one of the most talked about figures in the world today. Conclusion Mohammed bin Salman's life is a blend of unimaginable wealth, luxurious living, and significant political influence. His lifestyle, filled with extravagant purchases and palatial homes, contrasts sharply with the controversies that surround him. What do you think of Mohammed bin Salman's lavish lifestyle and its implications? We'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share if you enjoyed this glimpse into the life of one of the world's wealthiest and most influential people. Stay tuned for more insights into the lives of the rich and powerful.